थर्ड प्रॉब्लम इफ ए प्लस बी कॉमा ए आर एक्यूट एंगल्स सच दैट साइन ऑफ ए प्लस बी इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी फोर बाई ट्वेंटी फाइव एंड टेन ए इक्वल टू थ्री बाई फोर देन फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ कॉस बी लेट एस फाइंड आउट कॉस बी ओके ए प्लस बी बिलोंग्स टू द फर्स्ट क्वार दिस इज गिवेन एंड साइन ऑफ ए प्लस बी इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी फोर बाई ट्वेंटी फाइव लेट एस टेक ए ट्राइंगल राइट एंगल ट्राइंगल a plus b this will be 24 this will be 25 625 minus 576 49 square root of 49 is 7 so cos of a plus b becomes 7 by 25 okay now a belongs to first quadrant only and tan a is equal to 3 by 4 take the triangle this is 3 this is 4 this will be 5 now both sin a and tan a right sin a is 3 by 5 and cos a is 4 by 5 now we have to find out cos b so we know that we can write like this we have to write b value b is equal to we can write a plus b minus b sorry minus a a a gets cancel we get b only apply cosine function on both sides so cos b equals to cos of a plus b and minus a let us say a plus b is equal to something x a is equal to y cos of x minus y what is cos of x minus y cos x cos y plus sin x sin y so this we can write cos of a plus b cos a plus sin of a plus b into sin a so let us substitute the values cos of a plus b 7 by 25 into cos a is 4 by 5 plus sin of a plus b is 24 by 25 into sin a is 3 by 5 let us simplify plus 28 by 125 plus 72 by 125 125 lcm adding these two 100 25 4 ja 25 5 ja this is equal to 4 by 5 
फोर्थ प्रॉब्लम इफ टैन अल्फा माइनस टैन बीटा इज इक्वल टू यम एंड काट अल्फा माइनस काट बीटा इक्वल टू यन देन फ्रू दट फ्रू दट काट ऑफ आल्फा माइनस बीटा इज इक्वल टू वन बाई एम माइनस वन बाई एन ओके दिस प्रॉब्लम कैन बी डन इन टू वेस फर्स्ट द टैन अल्फा माइनस टैन बीटा कैन एक्स कैन बी एक्सप्रेसड इन टर्म्स ऑफ काट and taking left hand side also we can do the problem so otherwise considering 1 by m minus 1 by n also we will get the cot of alpha minus beta so let us proceed the first method given tan alpha minus tan beta is equal to m let us write this is 1 by cot alpha minus 1 by cot beta Which is equal to m. Now, cot alpha, cot beta is the LCM. So, cot beta minus cot alpha, which is equal to m. So, cot beta minus cot alpha equal to m cot alpha into cot beta. So, equation one. now one more given here cot alpha minus cot beta equal to n say 2 cot alpha minus cot beta is equal to n given from 2 so from 1 and 2 we get so now you observe this is not cot alpha minus cot beta cot beta minus cot alpha this is replaced by minus n so we get minus n equals to m of cot alpha cot beta now cot alpha cot beta equals to minus n by m okay now take left hand side here cot of alpha minus beta this is cot alpha cot beta minus 1 by or plus 1 this is cot beta minus cot alpha this is the formula cot of a minus b formula cot alpha cot beta is minus n by m Plus one by cot beta minus cot alpha is equal to so cot beta minus cot alpha is equal to minus n. This can be written minus one by n times minus n by m plus one. Multiply each term with minus one by n. So we get. Minus one by n into minus n by m. N n cancel. Minus into minus plus one by m. Minus one by n into this plus one. Minus one by n. This is R H S 